Xinhua News reports that a Chinese labor union and four former employees have just filed a lawsuit against Walmart. This comes after an arbitration committee rejected their demands for better compensation after Walmart improved the benefits offer. The whole issue is over the announcement of a store closure that did not follow the 30-day closure rule and gave employees two weeks to decide upon transfer or termination package. The Chengdu Walmart store announced on March 5th that the underperforming store would be closed down on March 19th, and the workers were offered the options of either to move to work in Walmart stores in other cities or end labor contracts with compensation. The majority of workers rejected the relocation option as the closest Walmart store to Chengdu is in Yiyang City, which is 100 kilometers away. Even though Walmart has offered relocation and transportation assistance to those who want to stay with the company, the real issue is that the store failed to inform workers or the trade union 30 days in advance as required by law, and no communication was made with workers before the announcement. 69 workers and the store's branch of the All-China Federation of Trade Unions have filed for arbitration by the Changda Municipal Labor Dispute Arbitration Committee on April 25th, asking to double the compensation, a request that was later turned down on June 25th. No disclosure was made regarding the exact amount of the compensation. The report says 63 workers have then signed the agreement to accept a settlement from Walmart of 3,000 yuan or $488 each in addition to the compensation package to end the dispute. The remaining six workers, however, were not satisfied and decided to file the lawsuit against Walmart China.